Hi, my name is Kathy Moyne and we're here at Green Thumb Nursery today to talk about Zygo Cactus. So you are probably more familiar with the name Christmas Cactus, Thanksgiving Cactus, Easter Cactus, and there's even a Summer Cactus. And they're all in that Zygo, Zygo family. So, and they are different. Now, one of the ways that you can tell that they're the you can tell which one you got is when they flower. We're in October right now, and we're just now starting to get the Thanksgiving cactus, and they do have a different leaf. As you can see on the tips of these leaves, there's points. Christmas cactus, the leaves, the tips here, these little points right here, are rounded. Thanksgiving cactuses are more pointy. Easter cactuses have a little bit different shaped leaf and so do the summer zygos, the summer cactus. But they all pretty much bloom around that time of their namesake. So these are blooming around Thanksgiving. And then the Christmas ones when they come are going to bloom around Christmas. And then the Easter ones when they come are going to bloom around Easter. And then the summer ones bloom in the summertime. So these are pretty easy to take care of. As a cactus, they actually like a little more moisture than your typical cactus. So when they're doing their thing, they're flowering and growing vigorously, you want to keep them kind of on the moist side. And then when, they, when they're not flowering and they're not doing their thing, then you can cut back on that water. I like to use Osmocote as a fertilizer, but you can use all different kinds of fertilizers on these plants. You can use liquid fertilizers, you just don't want to feed them when they're flowering. So about a month or two before they're supposed to flower their flower time, you want to cut back on the fertilizer and just let them do their thing. Now, uh, they do like to be root bound when, when they, they flower better when they're root bound. So usually you'll see a nice big plant in a smaller container and that's normal for these guys. You, when you do transplant them, you want to use a cactus mix. You want something that's going to drain real well for them and you want to put them in a bright area but not direct sun. Now if they're getting, if you're starting to see them turning purple and wrinkled, usually that means they're either, they need some phosphorus, which is in your fertilizer, or they're, they're, they're too dry, or they're getting too much sun. So these guys actually like to be maybe an early morning sun or a late afternoon sun or just a bright filtered light. They can be inside while they're flowering. I would, they do a little bit better outside because of the light issue, but there's no reason why you can't draw, grow it inside in a nice bright area. So these cactus, again, like I say, these are the Thanksgiving cactus. Again, we will have the Christmas ones during Christmas. And then again in the Easter, we will have Easter ones. And then during the summer, we have the summer zygos. So these are really an easy plant to grow and they're lots of fun. And as you can see, these flowers are just spectacular. And I have seen the hummingbirds heat, hit these guys. So again, Zygo Cactus. Thank you for watching. If you liked our video, please click the like button. Hit the subscribe button if you want to get more of these uh, videos. And hit that bell so that you know when you got a new one out. Thank you and have a great day.